Leandro Chassard officially signs for Arsenal Football Club and Arsenal have reportedly paid Brighton 27 million pounds to bring the Belgian to the Emirates Stadium. Mikel Arteta has also confirmed that Leandro Chossard's paperwork was done on time and that he could make his Arsenal debut against Manchester United this weekend. 25 goals and 14 assists in 121 games. Look, I think Chossard is one of those states don't lie but they don't tell you everything players if you know what I mean. I mean yes, it doesn't sound that great. 25 goals in what, over 100 appearances? But I've watched Trossard many many times since he joined Brighton and almost every time I watched them he was arguably their best player on the pitch. Creating space, good in 1v1 situations, quick and clever passes, good at shooting with both feet. Just by watching Brighton on TV here and there you could immediately tell that he's probably their best player. Although they are once again having a great season and a lot of their players have been in excellent form. But back to Leandro Chossard and my main question. Do I think he is a good signing for Arsenal? Absolutely. In fact, I'm honestly glad that the whole magic thing didn't happen. Because, like I said before, there is no planet in space where that type of player is worth 100 million euros. No offense to Magic, and I'm not saying that he won't be a great player in the future. And who knows, maybe in a few years he'll win the Ballon d'Or or whatever. But as of now, I just don't see how can you justify spending that much money on a player that is going to be on the bench for 90% of the games. And that's the reason why I like Trossard, simple as it is. Premier League proven, 28 years old, he is now in his prime and has no problem being a squad player who can make an instant impact when he comes off the bench. In my opinion, Trossard is a perfect addition to this Arsenal squad and these type of signings will bring you titles and trophies in a long run. Clever and affordable signing to strengthen your squad even more. Because let's not forget, we are fighting for the Premier League title, Europa League and the FA Cup. And nobody knows better than us Arsenal fans how one or two unexpected injuries can ruin your whole season in a moment. Not gonna lie, I like how Arsenal is handling things at the moment, I like this transfer policy. Just try to remember how Arsenal's transfer windows used to look like 5, 6 or 10 years ago. Panic buys, delayed reactions, players refusing to join us, always stingy with money. Just listen to this, these are our options on the wings for the rest of the season. Bukayo Saka, Gabriel Martinelli, Emil Smith Rowe, Leandro Chossard, Marquinhos and Rhys Nelson. Do you know what's that called? That's called depth. For the first time ever, ever, we are actually loaded with options. Oh, and let's not forget about Jakub Kivior, the new central defender that we reportedly bought from Spezia today. We are loaded. Although I still think that buying a new midfielder this winter is more important than anything else. But let's wait. There are rumors that we are in for a couple of names and that we are definitely going to bring in a new midfielder this month. So let's just be patient. And that is it. Is Leandro Chossard a good signing for Arsenal? Absolutely. No doubt about that. And I can't wait to see him in action. Thank you for watching all. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you on the next one.